So just down the road from my son's basketball uh, practice is this uh, store here. And I'm just gonna walk out of here a little bit out onto the sidewalk, show you the store here. Pretty cool little store, super nice lady. Uh, $1.50 for a cold Stella beer. $2.25 for a large club beer. Oh, I guess you can see all the prices are right there. Club is a very uh, popular beer here, I guess, but well, whatever. I'm not a big beer drinker. Uh, well, not, not a drinker really at all. But uh, once in a while, I don't mind to have a cold beer. There's a lady that lives across the street there in that little, little puny hut. I plan on going over there one day with some uh, groceries for her. Uh, I seen her reaching over the fence for a banana and an apple from the place that's right beside there in that fenced off area. And that little hut to the right is the one she lives in and she's gotta be in her 70s, maybe. But I'm gonna go introduce myself to her one day and uh, bring her a bag of groceries, some food, do what I can. You know, I don't make a ton of money, but I make enough that I can give. I can give what I can and uh, I will do that until the day I die. Uh, this world is so gross and disgusting with all the, all the, uh, all the conspiracies and the, uh, just the damage and the, the wars and uh oh, it's, it's just it's terrible man you know and uh what i can do is i can make a small small difference in someone's life today and that's what ecuador ron real is all about you know i got my i got my jersey on today i got my ecuador jersey on today i support this country I supported British Columbia and Canada for many, many years. 43 years I gave to that, that country to get Justin Trudeau in return. No, thank you, man. Yeah, they got issues all over the world, but you know what, man? Uh, fit in where you get in. And uh, I haven't been here for a year now. I can tell you from the bottom of my heart that... Uh, <laughs> where, where there's a pump located as well that I absolutely love it here. I'm never going to return to Canada. Um, you know, and, and that's kind of sad in a way because Canada was my home, home country for many years. But now today I call Manta Ecuador my home. I've made some very, very good local friends here that speak only Spanish. And I don't speak great Spanish, but... That's okay, we, uh, we connect. And, uh, yeah, it's all good.